I just picked up NBA 2K15, and it's time to start a career. But not with myself. Because, let's be realistic here, I could never possibly make it in the NBA. But somebody who I always thought could make it in the NBA was the street baller known as Hot Sauce from the And One Ballers mixtapes. And that's what I decided that I wanted to do with my career. So what you guys are seeing here right now is the creation of Philip Champion, also known as Hot Sauce. And guys, we are going to take the NBA by storm. I'm telling you, this is going to be epic. I'm going to have a blast. I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's go. There's my guy. Your guy? Your guy? Your guy was told by his agent that he was going to be a late first round, maybe second round draft pick. Your guy's supposed to be in New York with the rest of those chumps. Your guy, your guy's about to blow his freaking lid because his dream of being in the NBA is still just a dream. Hey, chill, man. I know this isn't how we wanted it to go down. Believe me. Like I told you, you're my last best hope at the agency. If you wash out, I wash out with you. But I was thinking. Maybe this was the best thing that could have happened to you. How you figure that, genius? Better to go undrafted and have a choice than to be picked late by a stacked playoff team where your chances of making the team are about as high as my chances of dating a supermodel. Which, despite my contagious charm, are pretty freaking slim. So what's the move, man? This just affects our timing, okay? You just gotta keep working hard and be ready. Injuries, overhyped draft picks. Sooner or later, players are gonna wash out and they are going to call you. You hear me? Yes, I hear you. Good. Remember, Jordan was cut from his high school basketball team and made fools pay for it the rest of his career. Use the draft day slight as motivation. A chip on your shoulder at the beginning of a long journey. And like every journey, this one begins with a single step. So your first step? is to keep working hard, and we'll find you a home before you know it. All right, man. I'm believing in you, bro. Make it happen. Undrafted? Basketball has been my life since day one. What am I going to do now? This can't be the end. Is my dream really dead? Okay, I know you've been staying in shape, working hard on your game, waiting for your shot. Yeah, so when's that gonna be? Because you told me not getting picked was a good thing. It was. It was. This is America. Freedom of choice and all that good stuff. And that is why I'm here. Now is the time. Teams are able to offer 10-day contracts at this point, and I've been on the phone nonstop. There's some definite interest in you. What's that mean? I get to pick where I want to go? Whoa. <laughs> It's not that easy, my friend. I, but there are several teams willing to give you a, a little tryout, see if it makes sense for them to sign you. Listen, man. First of all, you're not my friend. You're my agent. And second, where's the list? Because I'm ready to play. 
Keep in mind that these teams have varying levels of interest. If you want the 10-day deal, you're gonna have to work a lot harder to impress some of these teams than others. Man, I don't care about that. Where's the list? Okay, here's the list. Let me know where you want to go and I'll make it happen. Okay guys, so I have the opportunity to kind of choose where I want to go here. Uh, a lot of good options, obviously. Uh, most of the best teams are at the very bottom here in terms of interest. Um, but, you know, we've got some decent options here, I think, up at the top. I actually really think that I might go with the Atlanta Hawks, and the reason for it is because Philip Champion, a.k.a. Hot Sauce, is actually from Atlanta. So I'm thinking that that's where I want to go. I think, I mean, the, the Magic's probably the easiest, obviously, if I actually want to get playing early. Um, but I might as well test myself a little bit. I don't think it should be too challenging for me to get, like, an average. Obviously, I'm not going to be able to get an A-plus or anything like that. But uh, if I could even just get a C-plus, then I can make the Atlanta Hawks roster. So I think I'm going to try and do that. We played our, our whole lives balling on the streets, being an and-one baller. And now it's time to make it in the NBA. There we go, scoring on the very first opportunity. Move, man, what are you doing? We got our foot in the door. The Hawks have offered you a 10 day deal. Why not a year? Because you're an undrafted, unproven commodity. But they saw enough to take a flyer on you. So you have exactly 10 days, 240 freaking hours to show that you belong. You perform? You got a shot at a guaranteed deal for the rest of the season. We both live to breathe another day. You don't. You got a shot at being last in a long line of might events, and I'm probably out on the street too. Living in this rat hole. Hold up. Rat hole? This is all I can afford because you didn't get me drafted. <laughs> Let's call it a charming fixer upper. Now pack your bags. We're going to the show. Yeah, boy. I'm going to the league. I got my foot in the door, and I'm gonna kick this sucker down, man. <laughs> you better. I don't want to ruin any more suits sitting on these vermin-infested couches of yours. Man, it's my house you talking about. Finally, I'm in the league. You did well in the workout and in the scrimmage. He's a baller. You give him a legit shot, and he's gonna make the most of it. I mean, when it comes down to crunch time, there's no one... Ten days, my man. We'll see if he can swim with the big fish. If he does, he might have a shot to be signed for the rest of the year. He might even find himself a spot in the rotation. If not, son, he's back on the streets. You ready? I'm ready, willing, and able, sir. You'll see. Good. Get out of here. You too.